This is a program to reverse first n characters in a file. Again, whenever you are talking about characters in a file, we use fseek function. And uh, the algorithm is what? We need to first create a file or declare a file pointer to open a file and declare n number of characters to be reversed. And also you have to declare two strings. One string is sto used to store the first n characters and other string is used to convert those n characters means uh, you have to reverse it so for that you need to do you need to have another another string and in step two what you have to do is you have to use fopen function to create a particular file in writing mode so you'll write like this fp is equal to fopen file name comma wps and in this step three what you'll do is you'll write something into file in this fp so you'll either use fputs or you will use fputc it's up to you and in step four what you do is you will set the file pointer to the beginning of the file using fseek why we are starting from the beginning so we need first n first n character so it should read from the beginning so that's why you are writing zero over here zero means at the beginning so you write fseek fp comma zero seek set seek set always starts from the beginning and we are saying here number zero as zero means it starts from the first and in the step 5 what you do is you read the number of characters from the file and copy it one of the one of the strings so already you have uh, uh, asked you read user to uh, uh, declare uh, means read n characters right so in those n characters you will read and copy it to into one of the strings and step 6 what you will do is after copying you will reverse the data into another string means whatever the, for example you have read this for example, you have read this. So this has to be reversed. So reverse is what? S-I-H-T. So you have to reverse. This is in one string and this is another string. You will reverse it. So after reversing in step 7, what you will do is again you will set your file pointer indicator to the beginning. Because now your file pointer will be at this place. So it should not be there. So again it should start at beginning. So it will you will start here. And in step 8, what you will do is whatever the reverse string what you have written, that has to be copied. So that has to be placed into the string so you'll write f put s reverse string comma fp so that it will be placed that particular thing will be placed at that place and in the step 9 you will close the file pointer and step 9 you will close the file pointer so till now it is in w plus mode only so in w plus mode you can either read or write so that's why you have written w plus if you write only w then everything will be overwritten so that's why you have written only you have written w plus where it will be written it can be read and it can also be write. So in step 10 what you will do again open the same file for reading purpose. So that you will display the content. So which will result the first 10 characters in reverse order. Example if I take this is Satish Kumar and if my n is equal to 3. So n is equal to 3 means what? You are taking 4 characters. It starts from 0 right? So 0, 1, 2, 3. So your output will be what? S-I-H-T is Satish Kumar. Let's see the program now. So you are writing the program using command and argument. So your main should have two parameters. One is argc and int star argv. And next you have a file pointer and you need to count. This count is used to uh, uh, check whether you have given the uh, like you are you this is used to read the character read the characters and next you need c i and j to read the character and these are for these are for copying for index things and we'll, you'll know now fp is a and you need two characters we said already two strings one is for copying and next one is for reversing so i've taken a of 50 and s of 50 and fp is equal to f open of arg v on of w plus you are writing this this you are opening this as writing purpose and as well as reading purpose and you are writing now f put s as this is tutorial for reversing a string so this is this f put s what it will do is whatever the string you have written that will be copied to or placed into the file pointer now file pointer is placed is uh, what arg v of one this i will tell you how to write in command and argument and next is what you are doing is you are setting the point at the zero is the position so that you will read first n characters and while count less than or equal to argv of 2 this argv of 2 so in in uh, command line argument what you will do is you will give file name and as well as uh, number of characters which have which has to be reversed so file name will be in argv of 1 and number will be at argv of 2 and your this particular file file something you will store right that will be your argv of zero so now this is argv of one that's why you have written argv of one as file and argv of two is what your number of characters which has to be 
uh, change so that's why I have written RB of 2 here and also you are checking whether it is not equal to FOFP then what you are doing is as count equal to 0 you are placing the character whatever the character you are reading that is placed in A of 0 so for example if this is this is a string A of uh, 50 then in A of 0 you are writing those characters so for example you are having 5 characters then it, it will have T here, H here, I here, S here and space so count plus plus and next a of count is equal to slash zero this means that slash zero means that your string is completed so in this way so for a, a now now what you are doing is you have to reverse this to reverse this what you do is for i is equal to count minus one that means from here and j is equal to zero this j is equal to zero for reverse so s of j you'll write i greater than or equal to zero so it is what four four greater than or equal to zero and you do i minus minus j plus plus if this is true it comes down so s of 0 is equal to a of 0 1 2 3 so a of 3 so in this way in s of in s of 50 it will store s it will store i it will store h and it will store t again what you need to do is here s of j is equal to slash 0 should be placed so this will become s slash 0 because after this what it will become j plus 0 1 2 3 4 at 4 this is minus 1 so this is not minus 1 is not greater than or equal to 0 it comes out of the so 0 1 2 3 4 at 4 this of j is equal to slash 0 will keep so that you are saying that your string is ended and now again you have to place fc uh, to fp comma 0 comma 6 set so that your string again your uh, cursor will be at this place and f put s what you do now here you have to replace uh, you have to replace it with the reverse string so that reverse string is stored in where it is stored in s so s comma fp so now at the place of this you will have siht and close the fp now what you have to do is you have changed but do you uh, you have to see the output i mean uh, you have to see the content what exactly it is to see see the to see the content what you have to do is again you have to check printf after reversing the content of file is again you have to open the file uh, for reading purpose and you check whether it is not equal to null or not that is feo of fp so read that c is equal to get c of fp printf percentile c comma c so every time what it will do is it prints so we'll check out output how to do output right so suppose the given file is abc.txt and program is saved as reverse.c this whole program what we have written is reverse of c and the pro and the file text file whatever you are talking about is abc.txt then how to compile is you will go to c tc bin you will go to command prompt command prompt and you will uh, open c and the folder tc in that you will open bin and you will compile this as tcc tcc is tc compiler reverse.c if there are no errors you will get again the uh, again you will get the prompt so in the prompt c colon tc bin what you do is you have to write the file name without extension file name and this is what this whole file name and next abc.txt is the text file which you are writing that will become your rv of 1 and phi is what phi is the number of characters which you want to write so rv of 1 so after reversing the content of file is then you will get the reverse right this you have written 0 1 2 3 4 5 so you have maintained 5 characters so these 5 characters are reversed actually this word this is it should be there it is reversed and this is the is it's its tutorial for reverse string is your program thank you